In this video, I'll show you how to install and use large language models or LLMs on your local computer using Olama. LLMs like ChatGPT are all the hype today. In fact, they have become essential. And the way they work, it feels like magic. ChatGPT is great, but running a local AI chatbot on your machine itself is even better and it really ramps up what you can do with them. There are many advantages for using local LLMs. First one being they are free. You don't have to pay a monthly subscription like for ChatGPT. Then you get unlimited usage. And all your chats are completely private. Your chats are not sent to any servers and they remain on your computer. In fact, you don't even need an internet connection to chat with them. So nobody can spy on what you say to your chatbot. And you can even run uncensored LLMs that answer literally anything you ask them. They never refuse to answer. I've been playing with local LLMs for a long time now. It's become a huge hobby of mine. I've played with so many models and it's so much fun. Having your own chat GPT inside your own computer that you have full control on is absolutely amazing. And I use Olama, which really makes this whole thing exaggeratedly simple. So without further ado, let's get this party started. Okay, starting off, we'll be using Olama to download, install and run LLMs or large language models. Olama is a fantastic software that does all these things automatically and it's so, so easy to use. There are many tools that let you install and work with LLMs, but Olama is the most popular one. You need to go to olama.com or you can just google search for it. The website is very simple and minimal. Not just the website, the whole thing of installing Olama, downloading models and using it is very simple as well. And you'll be surprised at how easy it is to use. Olama is available on macOS, Linux and Windows. Whatever operating system you are on, you can just click on download. I'm on Linux, so I get a single command to install it. Yup, you just copy it by clicking here and then open up a terminal by pressing Ctrl plus Alt plus T, paste the command here and hit enter. This command will work on all the Linux distros, Ubuntu, Fedora, Arch Linux, any Linux distro. Give it some time to download and install Olama. As it is downloading, we can go and browse the models by clicking on models here. This takes us to the featured page where we can see some popular and trending open source LLMs. These are completely free to download and use. Olama is just a tool to download and work with these models. Additionally, you will need to download LLM models of your choice. Just like GPT 3.5, GPT 4, GPT 4.0, there are many models available here. We have Gamma 2 by Google, Llama 3, which is the most capable openly available LLM to date. It's quite impressive. To download a model, you can copy this command and run it. That is once Olama finishes installing. Make sure to download the model of proper size. This is crucial as most models come in different sizes. The Llama 3 8B model is powerful and the 70B model really shines. B here stands for billions of parameters. The larger the model size, the more intelligent that model is and the more system resources you need to run them. You need bigger and better GPUs with larger memories. The 70B model here will not be able to run on most computers unless you have multiple high-end GPUs and more than 50 gigs of RAM. Obviously, these specs are not seen in desktops and laptops made for general use. But the 8B and 9B models should be fine to run on most computers. I have 16 gigs of RAM and 4 GB VRAM and 8B models run ok here. Not great but not bad as well. But if you have lower specs than this, I recommend that you start with the smaller models. Even try out 533 billion by Microsoft and then move to bigger models. Llama 3 8B is what many people use on their computers as it runs great on most consumer hardware. But you can experiment with bigger and smaller models as well according to your specs. Start with a modest model and you can go bigger or smaller based on the performance you get. I've been using Llama 3 8B model and it's surprisingly good. While it doesn't even come close to the newer ChatGPT 4.0 or Cloud 3 Opus, it's still a great option to get some general tasks done. Ok, Olama has been downloaded. To install it, I need to enter my password. Just type in your password and hit enter. That's it. Here you can see that it has detected my GPU. To install models, you can just click on models on the Olama website. Yeah, we are on this page. So I will be installing the Llama 3.1 model. To install it, you just need to copy this command and run it. Llama 3.1 has three models. One is 405B, one is 70B and one is 8B. The first two are extremely large for my system. I'm going to go with the 8B one here. 
I'm just going to copy this command here, open up a terminal, paste it and hit enter. Now it will download the model, it's around 4 GB so it will take a while. LLMs are very complex things. It's actually quite surprising how well Olama works. Using just this single command, it downloads the model from Hugging Face, installs it, configures it and lets you directly run it and interact with it all from this terminal itself. By the way, if you haven't already, check out my course Linux Mastery Express. I've designed this course to level up your Linux skills very quickly. With this course, you'll get so comfortable using the terminal commands that your friends will think you're a Linux wizard. You'll get perfect with the most used, most useful commands and also learn advanced things like using the vEditor and shell scripting as well. Linux Mastery Express, link in the description, do check it out. Once the model is downloaded, installed and configured, you see this screen. From here, you can directly talk to and chat with Llama 3 8 billion parameter model that we just downloaded. Let's go ahead and say hi. You can see it's responding and the speed is quite good too. For those of you who are interested, I'm running an Intel Core i5 processor, 16 gigs of RAM and an Nvidia 1050 Ti with 4 gigs of VRAM. This model is running completely fine on my hardware. Let's go ahead and ask it something. Let's ask what is Linux and what are distros. Let's see how it's going to perform. By the way, this is completely offline. It's not sending any API calls or my query to a server anywhere. This entire thing is running on my computer itself. It doesn't need an internet connection to work. This is running completely locally. Yeah, you can see it's typing. Linux is an operating system that is free and open source. All these unnecessary stars or asterisks in the answer are because the answer is being typed in markup language. So this would look good in a text editor or a GUI application. But since this is in a terminal, the stars show up as stars. Yeah, distros are created by different organizations, communities or individuals. You can go ahead and chat with it, ask it questions, give it instructions and get some work done. And it's all free, no limits here. You can start this chat again by running the same command again. Of course, since the model is already downloaded, the chat will load up immediately. If you're not a terminal guy, you can install an application called Follow Mac. It connects to Olama but gives you a full graphical interface like ChatGPT. You can have multiple chats there. If you have multiple models installed, you can select which model you want to interact with. Additionally, you can tweak various advanced things like the temperature of the model, which basically sets how creative you want the answers to be. Follow Mac is pretty great. There are many GUIs available for Olama. Follow Mac is just one. It's available from Flathub for installation. For Ubuntu, you can just use the app image. Everything is linked in the description below. There's another cool app called Misty which provides a GUI for Olama that has many advanced features. You can even give that a try. Installing a GUI to work with LLMs is highly recommended as they give you a more organized way of interacting with LLMs. While the terminal is okay for short chats, a GUI app is a must if you want to get any meaningful work done with these. So definitely check out Follow Mac and Misty. The first one is simple and the latter one is loaded with features. Check out both and use the one you like. By the way, to use Misty, you don't need to have Olama installed. It will do that automatically. Alright, in this video, we installed Olama, saw how to install a large language model and had a chat with our own AI running completely on our own computers. These open source LLMs democratize technology and knowledge. This again demonstrates the power of open source, how we don't have to depend on large corporations. We don't have to pay the money they demand and we don't have to give them our data. With local LLMs, we are fully in control of our data. It's just funny that right now, it's Meta that has been rolling out powerful open source models and spearheading the open source AI scene. Maybe we treated Zuck too harshly. Alright, if you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, definitely consider subscribing to the channel. And if you want to see more AI local LLM related videos, let me know in the comment section below and I'll make more videos on these topics. And if you're interested in learning up your Linux skills, the link to my course Linux Mastery Express is given in the description below. It's designed to teach you Linux and take you from zero to hero within the shortest amount of time possible. You'll be using Linux like a pro within a matter of hours, so definitely check that out. By the way, Linux Mint 22 is rolling out and it's got some crazy new things going on. It's the next major release of the fan favorite Linux distro. I made a video on that, definitely don't miss that. Alright, this is the next text, signing out.